today's session we are going to build a drill down sales report for example we have a sales master in a sales we have a different regions and in the different regions we have a different sales person they have a some specific area where there are where they are going to be sell some items so in this way if i am going to assume a sales model it would In this table, you can see that uh, there is unique records, and we have another table that is sales order detail. Now, in this table, you can see order number, item number. So, if I am going to combine sales order and order detail, then order number is a primary and foreign key relationship between both tables if i am if i am going to build a report to drill down options so what i need to do here i need a query like this i in this query i i have a make a relation made a relation between order master and order detail table and uh, we have a query like order number order date customer number sales person id region id item number order quantity piece price sales case this is the all data which is going to be represent in our report How, so we are going to in our development environment here i have a report okay now in this report what i need to do first of all i need to create a data set so uh, okay and from the database I am just going to pick this query and paste in my data set property so the data set is ds sales order okay now you can see this is the field which is going to be used okay so we are not using any filter parameter here so now you can see here okay so what uh, what i am going to do here i am going to insert a table okay in a table just set the data set property to the table you can see here the data set name is ds now i am going to use order number order date customer number insert three more column here yeah one for each sales region id and another is region id and the another thing is i am going to add sales case okay now there is a color okay just preview the report now you can see here we have all the data in our report okay but there is no drill down so for drill down what we need to do here so we can see here that uh, there is no drill down so what we need to do here first of all just click in your order detail we can add here and we can add there also so what we are going to do add a parent group like so order number is our 
main component and they have multiple items so we are going to add a order group header okay now you can see here we have a order number okay now they have a multiple orders so order number is repeating here so what we are going to do here we are going to remove this column from here okay now look at the report again yeah we have order number all that the all the things now i am just going to move this column to upper okay same here for sales case we need to summary so we are going to use sum up sum function here here okay now we are going to reduce the size bold and order number should be 9 okay now you can see here we have created the first level of day. so now you can see here we are going to use you as a another order group like in so add a parent group that is order number add group okay add a. now you can see here now we have another option now we are going to add uh, in this section in the group property we are going to add a order details okay so there is a duplicate so i am going to remove this column also from here i am going to add item number order quantity base price and sales case okay so i am going to name it item number order quantity base price price and sales cash yes yeah sales amount okay. so for better understanding i am going to make give a color to this also as a yeah it would be fine for us now you can see here we have the deal report okay now we need we need to add a calab expand and collapse functional to my report so what so there is no drill functionality in our report right now so for so for doing this what we are going to do here in order details this is the inner group we are going to group property and in visibility we are going to use hide and toggle item would be the order number because in our report order is the main component component having multiple items so we are going to preview the report now you can see here all the items are listed here within the order and now you can see here in a design i'm just going to preview again okay it looks fine so you can see here we have a order number having multiple items so order number is the summary and uh, when we are going to collapse order number uh, and expand then you can see all the items within this order okay so in this scenario if we want to add the salesperson on the top of the order so we need to create a another group up on the upper order number so i think you are going to enjoy this video please subscribe my video on youtube thank you thank you so much